Tired of dealing with annoying flies, fruit flies, and gnats in your home? The Zevo Flying Insect Trap is your ultimate solution. Don't wait. Check out the link in the video description now to get your Zevo Flying Insect Trap on Amazon and enjoy a bug-free home today. An ammeter horse rider has slammed under fire Olympian dressage star Charlotte Dujarda for calling a mare B asterisk 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 years before footage emerged of her whipping an animal like a circus elephant. The Team GB Golden Girl was forced to pull out of the Paris Olympic Games on Monday, just days before the opening ceremony, after she was banned by the International Federation for Equestrian Sports, FEI, from competing. The video of the dressage star allegedly lashing a horse 24 times in one minute at stables in Gloucestershire was made public by a Dutch lawyer on behalf of a mystery client, who filmed it several years ago, but has chosen to release it only now. A horse owner has now released more footage which shows the equestrian star at Stoneley Show Ground swearing at her animal, calling it UB asterisk 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 shocking the woman filming her idol. The woman who filmed the clip in September 2016 and asked to remain anonymous said, I was around her a lot. I was taking a video at the time. I've not been a fan of her since, then. I had looked up to her since I was younger. The clip appears to show Dujarda struggling to control the horse before she becomes frustrated and swears at the animal. Commenting on video showing Dujarda allegedly whipping a horse repeatedly, the woman added, It is absolutely awful. I've had horses my whole life. It's a completely wrong representation of the horsey world. They are treated like absolute princesses. Dujarda declined to comment until the investigation process is complete. It comes as those within the equestrian world have continued to raise questions about the timing of the complaint made to the sporting body. Madeline Hall, former dressage correspondent at Horsehound magazine, said, The timing of this video days before the Olympics smells of sabotage. To me, it is suspect. Meanwhile, CEO of British dressage Jason Brodigam also raised suspicion stating the grievance was time to cause maximum damage before urging people to kind to the fallen athlete. Dutch lawyer Stefan Wenzing refused to divulge his client's identity. It is unknown if she is also from the Netherlands, which has always been a strong rival of Team GB in equestrian sports. But yesterday, Team NL swiftly batted away any suggestion the leak had come from them insisting that they only just saw the video after it was published. Ms. Dujarda narrowly defeated Team NL at the Tokyo Olympics in 2021, and they were due to clash again next Tuesday at the Palace of Versailles. A spokesperson for the Netherlands team said they regret the expulsion of our fellow athlete but also condemn the training method used by Dujarda in the video, adding, This has no place in our equestrian sports where the welfare of the horse comes first. We are aware the video was released by a Dutch lawyer, but would like to emphasize that the origin and the release has got no relation whatsoever to the Dutch Olympic team. We only just saw the video after it was published. On Monday Dujarda declared that she was deeply ashamed by her behavior as she bid farewell to her chance to become Britain's most decorated female Olympian. As well as being given a six-month provisional ban by the FEI, Ms. Dujarda was dumped by at least three of her sponsors, riding helmet brand Charles Owen, insurance company KBIS and Danish equestrian equipment company Equine LTS. The video shows Ms. Dujarda lashing a horse as it was trained in how to perform a PF, a form of slow trot. Mr. Wenzing likened it to a circus elephant being mistreated. In a statement on Tuesday evening, Ms. Dujarda apologized to her sponsors, fans, and Team GB. She said, A video has emerged from four years ago which shows me making an error of judgment during a coaching session. What happened was completely out of character and does not reflect how I train my horses or coach my pupils. However, there is no excuse. I am deeply ashamed and should have set a better example at that moment.